How's it going, guys? Mine Hacker sixty five here again. Um, I like to welcome you to Mass Effect Andromeda. That is what I am playing today, and um, just uh, I, I did play a little bit into it just to let you guys know, so I do kind of know what's going on at the beginning. It's kind of kind of throws you in, into it the story. To where it doesn't really make sense at first, unless you read into the lore and everything. So, I don't know. But, um, hope you guys enjoy, and I'll see you in a minute. Alright, let's get into it. I don't want to click start, I want to customize my character. Yeah, no. Alright. Oh, lord. Is that his face? Ow! Excuse you. I'm trying to make a video. Go away, Frisk. Five minutes later. I like that one. Choose name. It's not gonna be Scott. <laughs> Yeah, let's go that way. Hacker Rider. There we go. I don't really want to customize this one. I'm just going to go with customized story. Yeah, I had a male shepherd. I'm not afraid to admit to that. I have no idea how that affects the game. I really do not. I need to like have like loading screen music or something while I'm just doing whatever. No, in fact, the next loading screen, I'm gonna do that. Every great moment in our history began with a dream. Each bold leap forward was achieved by those willing to do anything to attain it. We are, all of us, leaving behind families, homes, the very birthplace of our species. Some for discovery, to see the unknown. Others for a new start. But today, whatever our reasons, we take the first steps toward a new future for humanity. Today, we begin to make our dream reality. In the year 2185, humanity lives in the golden era of interstellar travel. Our discovery of ancient alien ruins on Mars propelled our understanding of science and technology ahead by thousands of years. While many now enjoy the newfound freedom and challenges of the exploration in the Milky Way, others look to even more distant stars. For the hundred thousand adventurers embarking on this one-way voyage, the, be vo bah, the adventure begins now. Andromeda. Mass Effect. Yeah, the first time I saw that, I had to... Like, avoid squealing. Because it's like, ah! Because I love Mass Effect so much. It's like, I'm a big fan. I played through. I went and bought all three Mass Effects. It took a while to earn all that money. <sighs> love it. It was worth it. <laughs> I think it took me like two years to get all of them. If 
a big cheer. Andromeda Galaxy, Destination Habit Tat 7 in the Helios Cluster. If I can speak, that would be great. Hyperion Cryogenics. I believe Hyperion is the name of the ship that they're on, the giant one. Okay, I put too much definition on your cheekbones there, but it looks like your cheeks are swollen. Deep breaths. You're gonna wanna take it easy. I've been taking it easy for 600 years. Ryder, Scott, Recon Specialist, Pathfinder Mission Team. Pathfinder Team, eh? The ones finding us a home. Can you make it somewhere tropical? Nice, warm ocean? Summer year-round? How about we get him a cup of coffee first? He looks evil. He's like, like, eh. <laughs> yeah, we'll do that for you. <laughs> yeah, and I'll burn it to the ground. The selection process saw the Andromeda <laughs> Initiative evaluate thousands of potential habitable planets within the. I actually look all right from the side, but from the front is like. Phew. Scott Ryder, he looks all right. There. He's house. still looking evil. Look here. After discovering uh, an unusually high ratio of potential candidates, or Golden Worlds, the Helios Cluster was selected as our destination. Now you are a part of the first wave of Arcs arriving in Andromeda. You! Our new home for humanity. Makes it sound so easy, doesn't it? <sighs> easy is no I fun. Hope not. I signed up for a little adventure before we settled down. Well, buckle up. Sounds like you'll get your wish. Yeah. Over here now, the Pathfinder wants you all on your feet right away. He said mission ready within the hour. Any idea why? No, but I'm guessing that's where your adventure comes in. Obviously. Okay, everything checks out. Just one more thing before if I. If that's me when I'm like middle aged or in my plant. twenty early Sam, or late twenties, early thirties. Sam, are you online? Yes, Doctor Taparo. Good morning, Ryder. Are you feeling well? Ah, I just need a second to get my bearings. What's this about my implant? A routine check. After being in stasis, we want to make sure the connection's still live. As the team's mission computer, your well-being is my primary concern. Assuming the implants work as advertised, Sam sees what you see, in theory. We won't know for sure until we get you in the field. How are you feeling, otherwise? I'm ready I'm to get excited. Started. Readings confirmed. Yeah. I need to go. The neural implant is functioning properly. Caffeine always did make me jumpy. You're all done. Let's get you on your way. <laughs> Though you may want to hang around while we revive your system, it always helps to see a familiar face. I don't like the sound of that. Dude. I didn't realize how ugly it was. Yeah, oddly gorgeous. I guess we're playing the seaweed together. What's, the What's happening? It broke free! Just hang on! Engineering, report! I don't know what's going on. Remedy cloud base offline. Uh, I'm almost in the Hold on! One second, I'm gonna turn this up for me. It's probably like really loud for you guys, and like most of what I'm talking is just hard to hear. Everyone okay? But I can't tell. What happened? We're not sure. Sensors are scrambled. But it's good to see you're up. Feels like centuries since we spoke. This is the Pathfinder. Mission teams continue preparations. Cora, Riders, report to the bridge. You heard him. Let's get. Uh, we have a problem over here. It's Sarah Ryder. Uh oh. My sister. What? What's wrong? Oh. Scott. All right, Is my sister okay? Sarah's fine. Her vitals are strong. But the revival procedure was interrupted. I don't like the sound of that. 
Don't worry. It just means the process could take a bit longer than usual. Sam? I can't read My that. connection to Sarah's implant was suspended. However, her pulse, respiration, and brain activity are all normal. To be on the safe side, we'll need to keep her in a low-level coma for a while. Then let her body regain consciousness mm, excuse me. naturally. She'll be fine. Glad to hear it. Thanks, Lexi. Keep us updated. Ryder, I'll wait for you at the door whenever you're ready to go. How do you want to have I probably should have made his eyes wider apart, too. Okay, I'm gonna be like right in front of you. I remember how to run! <laughs> Thank God. That could have been the end of everyone. Cry away. Good job, Ryder. Now we can get to the tram. All right. That was you okay? Barely I saved lives. The adventure begins. Except for that I'm person. Sure What's wrong with you? Do you just fall over? Go ahead and... Alright, what am I doing? I'm going through the tram. Through the tram, through the tram. <laughs> Helm control, report. We're drifting. Flight controls aren't responding. First priority is stopping these outages. Mainline power's been knocked out. We're on reserves, Captain. They won't last. What's our position? Unknown. We lost telemetry. Sam, we need eyes out there. Attempting to adjust sensor array. Alec, please. You may be bad fun, but this is my really ship. Guys? Captain, the protocol's clear. In the absence of communication with the Nexus or the other arcs, we proceed to our appointed golden world. Solid ground. If it's Fix even it. out there. Nobody said anything about running into an energy cloud. And that's just a wild guess what we hit. Alec, I need to assess the damage. Stop the bleeding. We've got 20,000 people asleep on this ship. Let's give them a chance to wake up. Can you blame her? She is the captain. I think she gets the final word. Well, he might. This isn't about having the final word. Sir, call. Yes, sir. We're coming through. Don't get snappy with me, old man. God. Is that our golden world? That's Habitat 7. Hey! Leave my Jabarna alone. If we're lucky. Yeah, you... Yeah, I see you. All of our long-range scans told us it was in the green zone. Perfect for human settlement. Messing with my... Cat, you cat. It doesn't even look the same. We don't know how bad it is yet. Still seems like it's our best shot. Maybe. There's just a lot on the line. Sam? The energy from the phenomenon is dumping our senses. Planetary conditions are on there. We're marooned. 20,000 souls adrift at sea. And when the power runs out and stays out, we need to know if that's safe harbor. And if it's not? As Pathfinder, it'll be my job to find an alternative. It's what we trained for. But if this goes well, we are already home. All right, just make it quick. Harper, the rest of the team should be awake by now. Have them spin up two shuttles. Planet Fallen 30. Yes, sir. A stubborn one, isn't he? 
He cares in his own way. Enough to give him a chance. I suppose you're right. <laughs> give him a chance. Finder. If this doesn't work out, we'll need him more than ever. I need an ETA on our sensor repairs. We're blind out here. Captain done, huh? Seems like she's done with everything. <laughs> I'm done with you, I'm done with you, and I'm done with you. I'm just done with everybody. I'm just call me Captain Doug. I'm done with everybody. My sister's gonna hate that she missed this. Are all I have adrenaline junkies? I guess it's in her blood. She beat me into the world by one minute. Couldn't wait to get started. Well, don't worry. I'm sure Sarah will pull through. When she does, she's gonna want stories. So, let's get out there and find her some. Right, you'll want to get your helmet. And maybe stop at the good luck rock before we go. The what? It's an old super. Got it. That's yep, where's my helmet? The Pathfinder is now requiring sidearms. I've opened the armaments locker. We expecting trouble. Good luck rock, honey. Your dad was mountain climbing back on Earth. It Dad's rock. Falling. The way things are going today, we'll need any luck we can get. Yeah. I won't need this. I'm gonna go get my sad on. Now let's get to the shuttles. Yeah. Okay, pick up my yeah, predator one pistol. Hey Ryder. Yeah, it's, it's Kirkland, okay. right? It's just yeah. alien I think contact. We just before the Hyperion left Earth. Not sure if you know Greer. Hi there. Your dad say anything about what's going on? Tough to say. Sensors can't get a read on the planet. Uh, it keeps things interesting. Sensors yeah, are scrambled. It's a shame to go through all this training and not put it to good use. See you guys in the ride down. No sensor coverage, huh? I'll be flying by the seat of our pants. Hang in there, Sarah. Looks like Dad's already suited up. Let me take a look at this here. So just another boring day at the office, huh? Right, let's get if it to was, work, I guess. this wouldn't be any fun. I can't wait to find out what's down there. The I know what you mean. Can't wait to get out there. What it was like when explorers crossed the ocean. Nothing but stars and dead reckoning to guide them. And a map that said, here be dragons. Well, if they made it, we can too. And maybe see a dragon along the way. I prefer to eat lunch. Not be lunch. You're not a real explorer till you've got some scars or bite marks. Let's not get eaten. On that note, time to get to the shuttle. Dr. Carlyle, with everything going on, I think the Ark needs you more than we do. Pathfinder wants a medic on hand, and if that is home down there, I'm happy to knock on the door. If it's what we hope it is, it'll be one for the history books. You got a quote ready? One small step? I'm pretty you sure your dad will handle that honor. All right, team, button it up. We leave in five. Sir? We broke out the weapons as requested. Anything we should know about? Seem prudent given the situation. We'll be short-handed with Sarah out. I heard what happened. Your sister's strong. She'll make it. We bet on whose boots would hit the ground first. This isn't how I wanted to win. <laughs> she better. Well, knowing Sarah, she'll want to go double or nothing on who climbs the tallest mountain. Don't let it get you down. I need you sharp. I understand. Your mom would have been proud. Of both of you. Yes, Dad. Fix these. Okay, team, listen up. 
Okay. I chose right. each of you for the oh, Pathfinder well. team, not just because you're talented and passionate, but because you're dreamers, like me. We dream of exploring the unknown, of finding the edge of the map, and then discovering what lies beyond. When people look back on this, and they will, they'll remember we didn't give up. That we kept dreaming that our first few faltering steps in Andromeda were the beginning of everything they know. We only get one chance to be first. So, let's go make history. I've been waiting 600 years for this. So inspiring. I wanna go kick down doors. Archive period, this is Shuttle 1. Switching to manual guidance. Shuttle 2, taking your lead. Good luck, Pathfinder team. Where are you sneezing? Oh, you Whoa. didn't. Hey, look at that. Uh, Whatever it is, it stopped the Hyperion in its tracks. Alright. It appears to be an unstable mass. Dang. If you say so, steer clear of it. Getting some chop here. Gravity normally is detected. Let me see if I can even it out. My stomach would appreciate that. We're clear. Mm. Accelerating to cruising speed. Ryder, we didn't have a chance to meet back in the Milky Way. Name's Liam Costa, security and response specialist. Good to meet you, Liam. Hard to believe we're finally doing this. Why aren't Should you wearing your helmet? Shores? Beginning our deceleration. Planet's dead ahead. Okay, he still go. didn't put his helmet on. The flight guidance is scrambled. It'll pass. The controls are. Oh, there we go. Adjust approach vector. Three degrees to start. We're through. Holy. Shuttle 2, are you seeing this? Copy that. Doesn't look like a golden world from here. Ionization levels are rising. Stay on course to the landing zone. Oxygen levels are below minimum human requirements. Is this the right planet? Yeah. Keep it tight, Shuttle 2. Uh, the mountains are floating. Look, port side. That has to be advanced engineering. Hyperion, that's the pathfinder. <laughs> I like how he said that. Uh, the mountains are floating. <laughs> Yeah, a lot of help he was. Ooh, that's not good. Well, doesn't that come in handy?
Come in. Hyperion, Sam, anyone there? And on that note, I'm going to have to let you guys go. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you want to see more. And um, I'll see you in the next video, oh whatever gosh. I make. Thanks for watching. Oh, I'm wait. Before, be sure to subscribe. Check me out on Facebook. Mindhacker Space 65. No. Um, I'm also much. on Twitter. Yeah. And no I believe. Yeah, I think. Yeah, I'm on. What's it called? Um. Called... Tumblr. That's it. That's it. Tumblr. I'm also on Tumblr. <laughs> so um, I'll see you in whatever video I make next. Thanks for watching, guys.